Rabbit Tat was a busker's cat with a meow that was loud and strong. <laughs> the two of them sang of this and that, and people threw coins in the old checked hat. And this was their favorite song. Me, you, and the old guitar, how perfectly, perfectly happy we are. Me, you, and the old guitar, how perfectly happy we are.
week later, Sock took a stroll around the block and found her new friend looking thin. He's gone off and left me, said Tabby McTat. Then Sock said, My people, Prunella and Pat, would gladly find room for a fine tabby cat. Take him in. Next morning, old Fred left his hospital bed and found his way back to the square. But a brass band stood where the pair once sat. And the band played this. And the band played that. And Fred looked all round for his loud meowed cat. But Tabby McTap wasn't there. Thank you. 
If I had a cat, I'd be happy afar. Just me and the old guitar. With my cat, I'd be happy afar. It's Tabby McTat. <laughs> it's my long lost cat. Old Fred was ecstatically glad. The two of them sang of this and that, and people threw coins in the new checked hat. Why did McTat feel sad? He was missing his wife and his comfortable life and the dozens of things to do, like washing Prunella and pouncing on Pat and hiding the car keys under the mat <clears throat> and keeping the newspapers nice and flat and giving the pens an occasional bat. How could he tell the busk of that? from a shadow sprang Samuel Spratt. Oh, please let 